receive the gospel, which is the truth of the payment of Christ on their behalf, so that they can repent and believe. So that they can repent and believe. So that they personally can be reconciled to God. Because they don't believe. What is, when Jesus comes and he says, the first things out of his mouth are, the time is fulfilled, repent and believe the gospel. Believe the gospel. It was finished, it is finished, it forever will be finished. God is not angry with you. You are not at war with, you might be at war with God because of your wicked works, but God is not at war with you. Amen. He's not at war with you. He wants you to be reconciled to Him. Amen. Right? So that you can have peace. I, I, I want, I'm going back to this guy here. I, I can't get him out of my mind. I want you to not be able to get him out of your mind because He is all of those people out there. And He is us. He was fighting a war that did not exist. And no matter how much propaganda you dropped on that man, he did not believe it. Something else had to happen. What was it? The picture for me is him giving his sword. That's what does it for me. All weapons are given up. All weapons are given up. Even before that happened, in order to convince him that the war was finished, Somebody had to go and tell him personally. His commanding so, general. What's that? His commanding general. His commanding general. Even before that, Nokio Suzuki went to that man in person and sat with him and befriended him. He had to have somebody reach out to him in person. You can drop all the leaflets. Right? But if you are not a friend, Amen. it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. You, know, you have to have somebody sit by you around the campfire, get to know you, and tell you, Jesus loves you. Jesus loves you. The war is over. You need to believe that. You need to believe that. When you believe, it's to the saving of your soul. Amen. Right? When you repent, because you see the goodness of God. You know, the Bible says the gifts and calling of God are without repentance. Mm -hmm. Right? Who moves first? Does Hiro Onada move first? Or, did the, or, or was there peace made independent of him? Right? That's the only way this works, folks. And I think we get it mixed up. I get it mixed up myself sometimes because I'm a sinner. But you always have to think. That God was in Christ, reconciling the world unto himself, not imputing their trespasses unto them, but unto Jesus. And he has committed to us the ministry of reconciliation. Amen. Amen. Now, I'll close with this thought. I think it is of the utmost importance that in order to be able to communicate that it is finished, you have to know it yourself. Wow. Amen. You personally have to know it yourself. This is not an abstract concept. You have to understand that in the body of Jesus, through his sacrifice, Reconciliation, from the Father's perspective, has been made between you and Him. That that is something that is an accomplished reality in the person of Christ, that it is finished. If you believe that, it will lead to repentance, and it will lead to a new walk in the power of Jesus Christ. Because the reconciliation has already happened. It's not something that you are trying to obtain through your efforts. It totally cleans your slate and gives you peace of mind. It causes you to walk a new life. Right? Right now, as I'm sitting here, as I'm standing here today, I'm telling you, on behalf of God, as a minister of the gospel, it is finished. God is not angry with you personally. 
He's not. He looks, and the sacrifice of Christ is sufficient to make peace between God and humanity. And between God and you personally. God loves you. Right? God loves you. And so this ministry of reconciliation that is to go to all the world, this message that it is finished, that is to go to all the world, this message of peace, must first be believed. By us. Yeah. And so if you if you are uh, engaged in a war this morning that no longer exists, and you do not have peace in your mind because of wicked works that you have done, you need to repent and to believe the gospel because it's finished. Right? And when, when Hiro Onada surrendered his sword and he wept uncontrollably, wept uncontrollably because for 30 years he had been engaged in a war with an enemy who was constantly hunting him and there was nobody there. There was nobody there because it had been finished. Praise the Lord, it has been finished. Amen. Let's sit our closing hymn. Hymn number 632.
Lord, may this truth sink deep into our hearts and our minds. May it motivate all of our actions. May we see you, Lord, clearly and correctly as you are. As the benevolent, kind God who has made a sacrifice for the world. Thank you so much for hearing our prayers, Lord. We, we pray that you will empower us to go with the ministry of reconciliation.